Hello everybody and welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West where I'm moving the microphone slowly. Um, so I went to, I was gonna go try and go save at the, what do you call it? The campfire over here. And then I realized on my way over how many, like, uh, it, what do you call it? Like in-game notes there were. Files. There's at least two. So I just hoped the autosave would catch me, and it did, so hooray. Let's see what these have to say. A uh, new proposal. Tests are in and officially speaking, it's a no-go. Even with the latest mining bots and extraction techniques, vapor toxicity will exceed DCE mandated limits by 21%. But hear me out, there's a huge amount of 20 of cinnabar on under the surface, even after all this time. Capital outlay for construction and cleanup will be well within our budget, and aerospace demand for liquid mirror lenses is trending our way. Not to mention the market for vaccine thermosal. Overall, the mercury prices are up 12% this quarter alone. I'm acquainted with a third party that can help with the toxicity data. Oh, I see. Very discreet, very reliable, not just line shit, not a line item shit fixes either. Full proliferation through the database. She's not cheap, but well worth the cost. Once we're up and running, the deal is too good to give up now. Let me know what you think. So basically, they're just trying to cheat their way into some money by destroying the environment. How, how apropos. <laughs> Make a quick buck here, there. It's all worth it in the end. Just, no, no, it's not. It's really not. It's so short term. Report of criminal activity. I hope it's them. Uh, Mercury mining scam. Yeah, we have an on site undercover operative at a defense center bar mine in western Nevada. The operative has intercepted communications regarding a conspiracy to illegally reopen the mine, defraud the DCE, and expose local wildlife to toxic levels of mercury data, vapor data attached. We will give the DCE two weeks to investigate, after which we forward this information to all available Hollow News outlets. Life for Life, all for all. The Eco Anon Covert Action Committee. Yo, so it's not even like an actual like government agency. It's like a like a environmental like almost like a terrorist thing. Uh, two weeks is plenty of time, right? Like if you can't investigate in that amount of time, something like this, like well, well, it's on you. And it better be reported to somebody so that some somehow they're held accountable, right? This. <laughs> um, this is the uh, when she said that I somehow drained the water. I guess um, I was like, oh snap, that's cool. Oh, I keep thinking I have to do the the motion, but I don't. <laughs> So I wanted to see if there's anything else down here. Because I am so scatterbrained. Mm, I didn't take my ADD meds today. How exciting. Please let me out. Aha. Oh, I already did that one. Nope, I already did that one. Oh, look at all these people I have now. So the like the, the Demeter Poseidon Aether one so far. My my controller is drifting. That's really not good. Um Okay, Demeter looks different. The rest of them were kind of the similar. Demeter all of them are focusing on the fact that these these support these functions have to work through Hephaestus in order to function, so makes sense why we need him it, I guess. Demeter is responsible for the distribution of strange metal flowers. Because Tanaka Naoto loved poetry, Demeter embeds verses in the forms of code fragments and into those devices as a tribute to its creator. Sweet! Okay. We knew those had to have... They didn't really seem to have any, like, uh, critical function, but, like, the poetry that you read in Horizon... I, I don't... We haven't read any yet, because we haven't been able to unlock any in this one, but in Horizon Zero Dawn, you could read the poetry, and it was quite good. I enjoyed it. I'm not, like, a poet, like... 
connoisseur or anything, but I enjoy poetry and I enjoyed writing it when I was doing my English major, so it was just nice to read them. <laughs> and to like think that like an a like a code intelligence had written them was an interesting twist, you know? For a very what we would consider human pastime. To keep future humans from grasping his culpability for the robot plague. Ha ha ha. That's, uh, yeah, he was trying to be like, oh, they're too innocent. Blah, 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 blah. Could you imagine? Or I remember when we learned they were just like, they were, they were like ran out of food. They hadn't been taught anything past like basic like shapes and numbers, like primary things. And, uh,. Could you imagine? Just a bunch of teens. I'm surprised humanity survived, honestly. Just a bunch of teens let into the wilderness. <laughs> oh, jeez. Stripped of its database, Apollo still exists, but only as an empty shell. At this time, Apollo, deranged and semi-conscious, fled to a processor somewhere. So Apollo, okay, that's interesting. Apollo, the framework, I guess? An empty sh like what is it besides like maybe it's just like it's the running program it just doesn't have a database to access interesting interesting i didn't know that part artemis we haven't been able to locate artemis or Apollo, we have, we can find, we found Minerva. Hephaestus is rogue, we have Aether, Poseidon, and Demeter, but Apollo, Artemis, and, and well, Eleuthia we don't need anymore, so. <laughs> She's really cool, I like that lady. Very interesting. I think you can only be warlike for so long, you know what I'm saying? Eventually, it'll, I mean, Spartans eventually were destroyed with that, with their, like, wholehearted, like, at least, you know, I, I'm not, a, I'm not, again, I'm not an expert on the Spartans. I was never super interested in the Greek stuff. Um, but from what I remember from, like, podcasts and, you know, vague history lessons, um, they basically destroyed themselves with their, like, adamant, um, I mean, there's obviously outside influence, but they're adamant, like, uh, rigid, what is it, like, uh, adherence to their certain customs, like the exposure, exposure of babies that they were considered unworthy, you know, and all this stuff. Like, eventually, they just ran out of, they just ran out of numbers. They just ran out of people, you know? Oh, yeah. I mean, I assume he can still fight. Two arms is nice, but like it's not like it can still do stuff. I get that it's probably more difficult. Anyway, I am just. Do we have? Oh. Oh, I didn't. Okay. And a willingness to make hard decisions. Yeah. How dare you take her from me? Oh, whoever this guy is, I my controller is. Just drifting all over the place. It's interesting that so far some of the elder ones, uh, elder Tanakh, they're like, please, war sucks. You know? Okay, the capital of the desert sat scalding spear. Okay, because I was thinking they were like, because the capital was in the lowlands, and I was thinking they were having to get water from there. So I was very confused that whole time. I was like... <laughs> That's so illogical. It's still illogical to have it come from one source, but. The see, yeah, he's he was a he was a brash and charismatic leader. The other woman was meticulous and maybe like heavy-handed, but like you're in a survival environment. Like she had, she was the one who was making the hard decisions. Anyway, I have just been all over the place. I want to look at this question mark. And then, I guess... I hope I edit out most of <laughs> the beginning of this video. Uh, I guess we'll stop there on our way. Yeah, I just want to check out this question mark. 
There's another cauldron. And then we'll go to the sky people, I guess. I hope everyone's doing well, sorry. I, well, when this video goes up, never mind. When this video goes up, I have no idea how things are going to be going because I'm going to be back out into the fields and potentially not seeing my computer for a very long time. <laughs> or my PlayStation or whatever. So I have no idea how often these videos are going to be going up. Ooh. I forgot about my boar. Yeah, you know what? Well, let's, uh, let's just have a nice little jaunt down here. What's this? I can't. How do I get off? <laughs> Wait for me, boar. I must explore a cave when I come upon it. Oh, is this it? Oh my gosh, really? Cool. I don't even know if I found a use for these yet, honestly. Is that it? Cool. Glad I glad I did that. <laughs> I'm sure someday I'll be glad I picked up a, a bunch of those. Oh, you can pick it up from the back. Oh, that's that's just excellent, honestly. Okay, this is actually pretty exhilarating. Sorry, I was paying attention to the map. I'm making sure I'm going in the right direction. See, I'm going the wrong direction. <laughs> I was like, I gotta make sure. Where am I supposed to go? This way? So I guess if I follow the road, it's probably for the best, huh? Also, I am surprised I, these usually, um, at least in Horizon Zero Dawn, but it would eventually run out of time. Like, your, your, your download of them. At least I think so. I mean, the one that you rode didn't. You could always summon that. But yeah, I'm just I'm just surprised it keeps waiting for me. It's nice. I don't particularly want to talk to the cook in here. I'm not particularly interested in whatever she wants from me. I, I'm trying to get off my mount. Uh, but I am interested in seeing how, like, a seaside Tanakh location works. Ugh. Why would you just put spikes everywhere like this? They really are. Just They just leave it. They just leave all the machines out. Like, I get you're probably salvaging them. Don't, don't leave them in the water like this. They'll get all rusty. And it's not a good look. I'm sure it's exactly the look they're going for. <laughs> Workbench. I don't think there's anything I want to... Well, maybe there is actually at this point. I've been killing a lot of little animals. That's right, I need to go fishing. Ugh. Where do owls live? <laughs> oh, hello. You have stuff to trade? Ooh. Okay, so this is like that other one, but it doesn't have the canisters that you can throw. And the iron eater, we did already see those. Sorry, I'm just doing, uh, just doing my old, uh... What is it? Like, uh, taking care of business, my housekeeping. Elemental claw strider sack webbing. Holy moly. Stormbird, storm kit, apex frost core. Who is brainstem? These things are getting very specific. 
just upgraded everything I can to level two. Because I figure some of those outfits will still be useful. Ah. Can't upgrade much more. About, uh, I'm running low on shards. Guess I'll at least try to get everything that I use up to level one. Oh, here's the cook lady. Red hair? Keen eye? Big spear. Those ingredients mean a Nora warrior. What you said about your food making a soldier stronger, do you believe that? You think soldiers are the only ones with skills? Blades aren't just for war. Slice up the right ingredients and you'll be stronger in the field. With the correct preparation. Your friend doesn't seem convinced by your claims. The people here would stick their heads in the ground and drill out their dinners like grazers if they could. But I'm convinced. If I show Hakata here, if I show any of them the benefits, then the others will come around. I mean, you would think they would recognize that, like, prep, like food prep really does, like, help, you know? This meal can make me stronger? Stronger, healthier, more resistant. There are all sorts of benefits depending on how I prepare it. You vary your diet, you benefit from the different properties of the food. Look at the Osaram. They drink all that beer and come out barrel <laughs> So why is it so hard to believe that food could change you in other ways? What else are you selling? Dining delights, tastes of heaven, and meals to make a warrior of you. A, a better warrior of you. I just don't use the food very often, you know? I mean, sure, I'll buy, I'll buy one of those fancy foods, but... What ingredients do you need? Some bird meat and a little mystery ingredient. If it stays a mystery, I won't be able to get it for you. Wild bird's eggs. These soldiers won't touch them. They claim warriors only eat meat. But a true warrior takes every advantage. Okay. I'll get you those ingredients. See, Hakata? True soldiers aren't cowards in the kitchen. You can get the eggs from the island in Desert's Tier, the lake just outside the walls. As for the meat, plenty of birds feed in the grasses around the shores. Bring the ingredients back here, and you'll get that meal for free. Woo! I don't care! This is just me trying to figure out what's here. This writing, it's Karja. I think it was left behind by Marshal Fischer. Oh, dang. I'm finding clues from him. Cool. Okay, this is... This is I wonder why there's pages left around, if people are keeping them, or like... I don't know, it seems kind of weird to just leave your journal spread around. <laughs> but, uh, yes, I figured Salt Bite. It's like the Salt Lake... I don't think this is... Do you think it is actually the Salt Lake? No, it's not the right... Is it? No, because we would have passed through, like, the desert lands that, like, the arches and canyon lands and stuff. So, yeah, this is... This is more Nevada than Utah. Utah's over here. We already passed through arches over here. Ooh, it's over... Well, not arches. It was canyon lands. Canyon lands was over here. In here. This is somewhere in Nevada. Like you wanna live. Ah, don't yell at me. I think there must be... There's all these like purple and blue things in here and I think it must be... It's a, pla it's a pl crashed plane. So I think there must be a blue box in here somewhere. Blue box? Black box. <laughs> If only they made it a reasonable way to get in. Wouldn't that be wild? Let's see, let's see. Maybe I gotta go out here. 
Ah, so it's not like the last one where you have to climb around the outside. Uh, apparently, it's the, uh, right on the inside. You have to go in to where the hunter is set up, like the hunter shopkeeper is set up, and then pull down part of their shop in the back where there's a vent. Outlander. Oh, yeah, if I had been this is your chance to trade. paying attention. Also, if it had come into focus. Don't mind me, ma'am. Just pulling your house apart. You do that everywhere you yeah, go. thank you. Sorry. Thank you for... Well, I guess we can use it for storage. No, I thank you for... That doesn't make you eligible for a discount. <laughs> thank you for commenting on it. I didn't think anyone was going to comment on it. I guess we can use it for storage. He's handling it a lot better than I thought he would. Now I get to listen to sad things. And shut down engines one and two. You gonna pass me that bottle? You really think these soldiers can hold back those combat machines? Well, this was always gonna be a one-way trip, so I guess they're gonna have to. To enduring victory? Uh, to zero dawn, whatever the hell it is. <laughs> oh, well. Any chance it's a nice machine? This drink's warm. <laughs> I guess everyone found their own way to deal with the end. Yeah. Only so much you can do, right? My focus has detected another flight recording. Yeah, well, we already did that. Dang, that thing's going up pretty far. I wanted to kill, uh... Hopefully this this uh, this is super edited down. God dang, this is gonna take a while. Um, but yes, that thing got, got up and around. I really wanted to destroy it. I wanted to want to see how it goes. But now it's like I don't know, trapped itself up there. I used there was two traps here, and I used one of them. It got down at like half health, and I blew off one of its components down there. So, hopefully it comes back? I don't know. Let's go! Oh shoot, you can glide right onto it. That's cool. I am attempting mounted combat. We shall there, see how it goes. Whoop. Oh, it didn't go, it did not go well. I can't believe my guy is still alive, honestly. I think I just killed him. My bad. Hey, he spits, he spits the stuff at me. I think I can repair my machine. <gasps> no, it's too late. I ran out of time. I'm so sorry, machine. Oh, man, I was so close. I don't mind just running through the wilderness. Not now that my mount's dead. I can't summon it, <laughs> which is fair. <gasps> I think that's an owl. Oh, my gosh, it's an owl. Nice. It's not what I need, but it's still good. Oh, that was probably a little unfair. I don't know if I've ever heard of anybody who really just who eats owl. I'm sure people do, or did. Oh, 
ground's getting steeper, air's getting cold. Should be getting close to stone crust. This part is reminding me of the Nora homelands, honestly. It'll be interesting to see new like this will be everybody actually, because we helped the desert people, we made a stop in the lowlands. Now we're gonna be Oh, I was like, where are we? Where? Oh, okay, okay. I was like, we aren't at him yet, so. It's just a little, little, waste, a little wayside stop. Nice. Oh, you don't even sell weapons. You just sell things I don't need. Nah. Good. I will take your stuff for free, though.